What's up, people? Probably you guys have seen or watched uh, the America's Cup uh, 2024, SWC America's 2024 in Las Vegas. And I watch it. It's very interesting. It's very intense. The battles are all very good. I mean, of course, there are procs here and every here and there, of course. But the most uh, insane match, I feel like it's uh, the semifinals between uh, True Will and Zezas. Of course, you guys uh, haven't watched it yet. Go watch it. Come back to this video or something. But Ramail and Judaya, True Will's Ramail and Judaya is insane. It's insanely good. I think probably, I think uh, True Will's Rama and Judea should be on Swift. I didn't see him proc, so it's not on value, so it should be on Swift because it's pretty fast. I mean, all True Will's runes are definitely insane, right? So, this is my uh, Rama and Judea's build. <laughs> I know crit rate. <laughs> yeah, because I have this rune because of the speed. I want to make my Rama and Judea as fast as possible, so. At least when I bring it into uh, whatever team I use uh, this two these twins with, he can they, I mean because they are Rebel and Judah, they can move first. The twins, these angels, can move first, and then he can choose which units to move on my team as accordingly as I needed against whatever opponent like I fight. Right, so that's why this is like my fastest. I think I, I, this is like the best probably that I could make. Probably I could make them faster, but I want... I can get 100%, why not? So that Ramal and Judai can um, do some damage too, can contribute beside for the support, right? But of course that means the hit points is not that tanky. Okay, so it's on speed. Okay, these are the rules that I have on my Twin Angels. It could be better, but I mean, this is nice. You see, I have this like 31 speed, 34 speed. I mean, of course, grinded. This one, I think, is 29. Is it 29 grinded? Wait, how do I see? Oh, 28. 28 and then max grind. Max ancient grind. So this is pretty good, pretty good in terms of the speed, I meant. And then, of course, they have some stats. These are like probably my best swift set. I know this is like hero because this is... It could be better. Of course, it could be better. Okay, this one could be... This is 22 plus 5, of course. I think this is also same 22 plus 5. So I couldn't get... This one is probably my only uh, quad speed on a swift run. Okay. So this is like the best that I could get with this kind of speed. And then also I want the twin angels to do... The twin angels? Yeah, the twin angels to do damage. So I have the crit rate. And then of course... My artifacts is like additional because they hit like they have multi height multi -hit, multi hit right not this one this one is like the support this one is the one that do uh, damage I mean only the th actually only the third skill sorry it's only the third skill that's multi hit my bad this is not multi hit this is stun but a low chance to stun but this one is like the strip and then the multi hit this one just decrease attack bar. So maybe, do you think I should just change? I mean, I have the first attack damage at least for these two, right? And then this one, only the first hit will have these advantages. Maybe should I just go, instead of the additional damage, should I just go for a crit damage for skill 1 and skill 2? But I think, right, I think, um, uh, I think they are skill 3 hit 3 times though. Crit damage on skill 3 is nice too. But I think uh, 
the damage multiplier for the skill is not that high, right? So additional damage probably will uh, do more. Will will have more damage. Oh, this one is ah, oh, but the hit points when revive is kind of useless. <laughs> yeah. I oh. Hmm. This could be cool, but that means we don't have the first attack damage on like the first and second skill. I feel like this is still better. So that at least we have some additional damage, some additional damage, even though this is not this are not that high, but 12 10. This this should be better than this one, right? Yeah. Oh, this is pretty nice too. Speed proportional to loss hit points so that I mean he's doesn't have he doesn't very he's not very tanky anyway, he gains more speed when his damage uh, when his hit points lower. Ooh, on turn one target plus eleven. Hey, this one pretty nice too because it's all single target. Oh, this one AOE. Oh, that means skill two doesn't get this one, but this one got the one turn additional uh the crit damage too, right? Can I just do this and then get recovery skill one? It's kind of useless. It's a recovery skill two, I believe. Accuracy skill one. I mean, he has some accuracy, 67% accuracy. Additional damage? Defense? Nah, he doesn't have a very high defense. Ooh! Wait, do you think this could be better than... Oh, but the... Wait, hold on. This one is 12 plus 10. On the first hit, is 22. But then the, the other hit is 12. With this, it should be 17 all around. 17, 17, 17 plus additional hit points. And then the crit damage is like 17%. Oh, do you think... Wait, which one do you think is better? Left or right is better for the... This thing. If I build them with the, the Twin Angels with crit damage. What do you guys think? Hmm. I wonder what True Will's artifact is for this unit. Right, because additional damage and uh, no 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 the artifact contribute to the damage too right probably additional damage is only for the third skill right is there anything i could do on this uh i guess i don't have a very good i mean on hit points there's like not very good artifact on on Oh, there's own target, right? Do I have own target on this? Let's see, own target, crit damage. Own target, own turn. One target, crit damage. Oh, this one I can't take because I like Siri, right? I like Siri, this one I'm using right now. Why is this thing has own target, speed up effect, own target only 4%. Own target 4%, we don't counter attack, so... Well, I don't have a very good own target. For, why do I keep this rune? Uh, this artifact. That artifact is useless. What is this? Uh, nope. Not very nice. Ooh, wait. This is attack though. That means I'll take away a 1500 hit points for this. Which is almost the same thing. But now I have CD as more enemy hit points. I think this one is better. No? Yeah. This one is better. In terms of this, we are almost the same in terms of the additional. And then instead of the CD crit damage as more enemy hit points, now we have own target which is applied to... I mean, this is better, I think. I think. And then this one, if you want to change the own target one damage one. Hmm. This one. Is it this one? This one, but then we take away 6% crit damage on skill 3 and 4. Uh, skill 2... Crit damage... Do you think this one would be better? Than this? If I put this... On target... Crit damage will become 22%. Is this, is this better? Do you guys think this is better? Than the other one, than this one. What do you guys think? Huh. 
So now he has additional like 23% uh, crit damage. Right? When I get a turn, of course, when you move on your... Uh, uh, this is probably better, no? I mean, at least he's sort of like a support unit that do damage. Ah, I, yeah, I'll put it like that and then I'll try him. I try these Twin Angels out when we have our new RTA season, of course, um, just coming soon, right? Monday. Now is Sunday. So tomorrow we'll, we'll have the new RTA seasons. I could try the Twin Angels out with uh, this, this artifacts. And then we'll see what happens. I mean, it's lower hit points, but that's okay. I guess that's okay. I don't know. That's okay, probably. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, we'll see whether this one can do a bit more damage. We'll try uh, this guy out, of course. Okay. So that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Bye.